Guys, we finally made it. Today is the day the Supreme Spring Summer 21 catalog is out. I feel like I'm chosen. I'm covered in gold. Lookbook is here. The preview is among us. Look at me now, 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 now. They pay me to flex and shine. I'm up. Let's get it. Before we get started, I did get a couple of things in the mail today. Nothing too crazy. Uh, I just didn't think this warranted its own video. Uh, these are the 77 Blazers, the khaki suede. These have some kind of like some Travis vibes a little bit. If I get an in-store sign up this week, I will be wearing these out to Supreme. I don't know if you guys are in LA and you see me at the Supreme store, please say hi. I might think you're a crazy person or a homeless person. It is Los Angeles. I might mace you. Say hi either way. It's worth the risk. Let's get into this. My battery is not going to last through this whole thing. Supreme, yes, here we are. We are on the Supreme site. I'm so excited. Who's excited with me? It almost feels like it's been a hundred years. I'm so excited to get going on this. Let's jump into it. I'm gonna do a view all. And let's take a look at these. There's not a whole lot of great pictures. Okay, so jackets. We'll start at jackets. Why not? Start at the top, go down. Um, bandana faux fur. I don't really like the pattern on them. But the faux furs always do pretty solid, so you can't go too wrong with that. No suede Harrington jacket, no thank you. The Vance and leather jackets are always very, very nice, but they're really expensive. Um, like these, like vests, I mean, they're, they're gonna be $500, like Spider-Man vest. Jamie Reed, it's all bollocks. Now I saw this is one, this was on a uh, lookbook picture I saw earlier. Yeah, I'm not really feeling these jackets. Uh, now these are cool. These are what, down puffers. I'm not a huge, I wish it didn't spell fuck at the end of the day, but uh, it is what it is. I think this is a cool design, uh, but honestly, this one here, like, look, look, look. You got some Jordans right here. Who? You got some Jordans on the jacket. I mean, what is that? Stop it. Get some help. Um, also, I saw this. I, these are kind of neat jackets, too. And if you really, really look closely, these are all little box logos. So the, the digi camo pattern is made out of small Supreme box logos. How many, I don't know how many box logos are on here, but if you times that by 100 each, it's a big resale. Uh, okay, keep going. Now, this might be the piece of the lookbook, as they say. Uh, if you notice, all the designs on here are older Supreme uh, logos that they've used uh, prior. So there's a lot of really cool vintage uh, designs. You see the taxi driver here, the chicken dinner, 666, the dollar bill, Supreme bounty things. I mean, it's like all their old logos. So uh, it's a really, really cool piece. And I think there are other pieces in that collection. I like the black one way more than, than this color. Uh, there's another leather jacket uh this piece is amazing this fleece right here this will this will be a big one uh that looks super nice like a stained glass window not the colored one is very nice link side parka no nobody wants a parka this might be neat oh michelin ness okay i don't like that color oh i hate that design too oh this was the one okay so this was the piece that was leaked these things eagle hooded work jacket uh okay that's some carthart stuff there i don't know why they don't do a carthart collaboration um i like these are nice and clean but i feel like they're either trying to make stuff really really clean or just completely out there i never really like their track stuff to be fair uh, Ooh, dragon jacket let's check this one out See, this one's kind of nice because it's not too crazy. Is it, What's on the back? Oh, it's just a dragon jacket. It's okay. Frayed trucker logo denim. Um, this one kind of looks like the fake Louis Vuitton one they did last year, but it says Supreme all up and down it. So I feel like that's maybe too much still. Uh, this one maybe isn't too bad, the black one. Uh, barn coat. I don't know what a barn coat is, but not interested. Reversal tech work jacket. I just want to see what this looks like. Oh, okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. Okay, I, I, I've I kind of wanted one of these little coaches jackets. I was looking at Palace had some really cool coaches jackets last year, and I never pulled the trigger. Yeah, lots of browns this year, too. Uh, they're, they're definitely Travis Scotting us up this year with the browns. Not too interested, not too... In these are probably nice, again, nice clean ones. These guys are kind of fun. Uh, they have matching pants, I saw. Okay, these are... I think I like this way better than the paisley pattern that they've been using i think this looks 
pretty nice, actually. Okay, yeah, these are pretty neat. I would say that the purple one, for sure, is the winner on that. And these will be fine. Reflective zip-up hoodies, the black ones. Again, black jackets usually do fine, as long as they're nothing crazy or ridiculous. Okay, let's look at shirts. All right, here we go. Cans shirt. Okay, cool, yeah, so uh, if there's any aspiring uh, trash diggers out there, the damn uniform for you. You can get any can you want out of any trash can if you have this shirt on. Uh, okay, there's an upside down fuck you, so that means that's probably is a good thing. Does this say Supreme all on it? Yeah, that's a little bit... Uh, you know, when I, when I look at these from afar, they look kind of neat, and then when you just blatant Supreme all over it. Uh, this one's kind of cool. I wish they had a different... Hopefully they have a different color. Okay, cool, yeah. I kind of like this one. All cotton ripstop. So that would be interesting to see if it all glows, maybe? That would be weird. Um, they got the Muhammad Ali zip-up shirt. This is... It's, uh, it's too much of a pattern. I think he's way too big on my shirt. But again, awesome that they're using Muhammad Ali. Dashes wall rayon shorts these shirt. This one's a pretty cool rayon. Oh, it's all the news article. I like that one. That one's kind of cool. This is, th These rayons actually look better than they have for the last two seasons. And I like this style and I like these colors. I wish it was more than just a candle. Um, I do think this is a banger of a rayon shirt honestly i don't really wear rayon shirts though but i do like this pattern uh okay some iggy pop shirts okay this is cool too uh, this one's really neat the bowery i'd say the rayon shirts are actually a lot more on point than they were last year that being said i don't think anybody cares about rayon shirts okay bandana silk shirt <laughs> i don't know i think the bandana thing maybe is old now all right, tops and sweaters. Let's see what we have in tops and sweaters. That money shirt is a street sign. Oh, I thought it was money. Street sign sweater. No, thank you. But these cardigans can be nice, but I don't like those. Fuck all sweater. That's nice. Ch the Che zip up hoodie. What is it made out of? A sweater, a zip up sweater. This is kind of cool, but you need, to, you need to know who Che is and rep him right. Inside out logo, no thank you. No thank you. No thank you. Not interested. These... Is it, what, is it, what kind of sweater? Cotton blend? Yeah, no thank you for those. Um, wow, this is probably 4th of July shit. This is ugly. This looks like they went online and made those. Don't like those. Okay, now these guys here, these might be your cardigans. These are kind of neat. Like this brown one, maybe? The tonal checkerboard small box sweater. This is kind of nice. I mean, for a sweater, I feel stupid, but bam, right there. Like, that's not bad. The Biggie shirt, you gotta, gotta represent the Biggie shirt. Beetle soccer top. No, I'm not a fan of their soccer stuff. I'm not a fan of their jerseys in general. Uh, mosaic top. I feel like it's gonna be more expensive, though. It's a long sleeve top, so it's probably gonna be 80 bucks. I, I would buy it if it's not too terribly above that. I actually would wear this if it's not too crazy. Um... They got a lot of chase stuff this year. Okay, this one's kind of neat, but it's again, it's I don't know how many people are wearing are, are rocking this shirt anymore. It's something for like a twelve year old at this point. Like again, like I like I'd rather wear this shirt than the last one. If if I say anything, oh blurred arc. Uh, it's like the bleed logo from last year. Uh, okay, this one's kind of, this is like the Joker long sleeve, sort of. Uh, I do think it's okay. Okay, they have a bunch of them. This looks, the black and white one looks like you're in jail. You can take this one and rock it right into the brink if you need to. Okay, next. Uh, small box logo. Oh, small box long sleeve. A hex zip up polo. So there's some polos here. Bleached velour. Split logo pullover. Okay, labels polo. Man, I'm not a big polo fan from Supreme, or really anywhere. I think this one's neat. This looks like new stuff, though. This isn't the same as the other one. A striped pullover lore, that's okay. Dyed bear long sleeve top. Okay. It's kind of neat. Is there more of these? Oh, there's two of them. Okay, like the purple and blue, green and yellow. Okay, these are, these are kind of neat shirts. Small box T. Oh, okay. Are they gonna do okay? They got all the Paisley small box logo tees. I just don't like the. I don't really like the pattern that they put on there though. It just. I don't know. It doesn't look right to me. I feel like I've seen much cooler Paisley patterns, but uh, again, those will do fine. Uh, pinstripe. No. Old English collar. Not really interested. Uh, necklace girl this is a cool design but i mean who the hell's wearing that splatter okay this is kind of neat is this a short sleeve top though okay it's gonna be expensive and it's embroidered yeah this one's pretty nice actually i kind of dig this one okay i mean maybe the black one if, if the black one had red on it 
but it's not going to. Okay, look at these. These are cool. I've seen these now. The denim one, whatever, but... And look at the black one. Ooh, look at the back. All those patches. That is a nice jersey. The black one just makes this design pop big time. Uh, that's something that you guys probably should pay attention to. This is a super, super cool jersey. I don't like their jerseys, so if I think this is a cool jersey, it's probably a good one. Um, even this one's kind of neat, the San Francisco, New York kind of collab here. I just don't like, I don't like the don't hate 2021, you know? I just don't like this message on the back. Like, just put Supreme 2021 and it'd be fine, but don't hate on my jersey. Mm-mm. Arabic logo soccer jersey. Honestly, that's not a bad soccer jersey. It looks pretty cool, and it kind of actually looks like a real soccer jersey. That's, that's like from the 90s. They used to do that. Okay, here we go. Skull top. I do kind of dig this one. Yeah, I, I think these are cool. Okay, I will go for one of these for personal, for sure. I probably will go for a purple or a green. I only have a damn bunch of black shirts. I need something with color in it now. I, I don't think it's going to resell, really, but... I like it. No, this design, they're trying too hard. I see this on everything right now. All right, so sweatshirts. Ooh, this is nice. I like this one. The black one might be cool, but that purple one with the yellow pop is nice. Stacked crew neck. Okay, that's that's pretty interesting. I don't hate this one. I bet this one would be okay. Ooh. Ooh, okay, there we go. This is what I'm talking about. This is the one Cause Chalk Logo Hooded Sweatshirt. Uh, oh my goodness, I gotta get that black one though. I told you I got too many blacks, but the black or the green maybe? Oh yeah, is that purple? I like purple too, but green isn't bad. I, whatever, man, I gotta get a couple of these. That's the item of the year so far, as far as this lookbook is concerned uh, on the clothing side. Okay, this might be a good one for your lady. This one right here in small. Okay, look at this one. Oh, they're not playing games. A Swarovski Crystal S logo hooded sweatshirt. Those will be expensive, but I'd love to see the colors on some of the other ones. Uh, the rainbow one again. This one, small, probably will do well. This looks literally like they put a basketball jersey on a sweatshirt. Gons Stars hooded sweatshirt. Okay, so again, I would say these are good for ladies maybe in the small. You get you get the any, the black one in small and this one will be good too. The hooded sweatshirts don't look too awful. What's that? The fuck off? Okay. Love hooded sweatshirt. No thanks. Now I saw this one and when you, it doesn't look like much, but I feel like those look pretty neat. I really think that these brush strokes on these are really cool. Now, will these resell? Not sure. Oops. Uh, Supreme registered trademark. That's fine. Okay. The Gons. Okay. So this one will be decent. This is, if you're going to go for a crew neck, this will be a decent little crew neck. Probably the black one, uh, assuming the Gons logo is still colored. It'll look really nice. Embossed logo. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah. You can see it better here. Again, I think that's the key this year. It's either going to be real subtle or real over the top. A don't care hooded sweatshirt. I don't care if you care. Supreme. That's not bad. I like the design. What's this one? Small box logo hooded sweatshirt. Those are always decent ones to pick up. I, I really missed out on that uh, zip up face mask -y deal. I like that a lot. Uh, this is kind of a cool hooded sweatshirt, but again, it's it's gonna be, it reminds me of, like the Ram LZ stuff last year. Probably won't resell, but it looks really cool. Panthers hooded up sweater. What is that for? Okay, I like this one. That's kind of a cool uh, panther there. Ooh, this is a nice one. Okay, what is this? The Hearts Hooded Sweatshirt. I bet you this one will come out this week. A uh, big logo hooded sweatshirt. Vampire Boy is stupid. Old English Wrap. Okay, okay, that's kind of neat. Yeah, it's pretty neat. Uh, again, oh wait, this one's neat too. Oh, so this, is this a hole? Are these holes through the damn sweater? I mean, what the hell you got a sweater for if you want to put holes in it? Okay, these guys are kind of neat. This arc... FTP arc hooded sweatshirt. Okay, so like the FTP. I don't know if that's what that was going. But uh, these are nice. Big, nice big logos. The purple. I like the black. The brown is nice. Again, lots of browns this year. Um, Small box logo zip up hooded sweatshirt. Alright, pants. I'm gonna do pants fast because they don't usually have anything good. Okay, like the patched denim pants. Those are kind of neat. Here's a little busy. Um, not really interested in these. I guess I like this one. I like that hooded sweater better than this one. Uh, some chino pants, skull jeans. Oh, it's a little bit much. I, I don't know what you do with jeans, to be honest with you. Just kind of put some jeans on it. 
Um, now, this panther thing kind of looks better on pants, to be honest with you. S logo Swarovski Crystal Sweatpants, when you got to have that Swarovski Crystal Sweatpants. Okay, so we'll get a, we get a look at what the colors are going to be. So they're all going to be silver, except for white will have rainbow. Um, let's keep going. Uh, that didn't take too long. Shorts. I will go even faster through the shorts because they're not very good. Oh, look at these. It looks like you're ready to, like, this one looks like the janitorial special. I, I'm not really, it looks like you're about to clean out some kind of very clogged drain. Uh, I do like the jersey from this one, too. That was kind of neat and a classic-y looking supreme thing. If you like shorts, you know, get into it yourself. Let's get into t-shirts. This is important. Okay, so these t-shirts, these are going to be the t-shirts that will release week one. It's not looking great. We got this thing that looks exactly like one of the last t-shirts that they released it has the same logo on the front of it and everything i didn't like it then i don't like it now <sighs> the prodigy shirt this will be one you got to pick up it'll it'll go fast it'll sell out i don't will it resell i don't know honestly i probably will buy one of these for personal this little superman skeleton thing i have a lot of things that say supreme so it's hard to wear them all the time the classic shop tees they do them every year Get them in black, extra large, and you'll be fine. Or smalls, if you can get smalls, get smalls. Those are the ones to go for! Um, the ear tee. I, I don't know if they were listening because nobody wanted an ear tee. Um, they must be deaf over there. Nobody wants to hear that or see that. No, thank you. Okay, I like this design. This is the number one t-shirt of the week, in my opinion. The other ones aren't really that great. I, I imagine we'll get some other ones. This one, too, I like... I like this this mouse. I might go for a mouse for the personal. Again, I'm gonna try to get some colors because all I have is black. So if I get a couple of personal shirts this week, I will be getting some that are not black. And then if I'm going to sell them, I'll get them in black. Uh, if you want to resell things, please get them in black. It's the it's the smartest thing to do. It's the most wearable color. Um, this one's okay. At least it's a decent little design or something. But again, I I don't I don't know what they're trying to do here. Wind tea. So we can melt. So first of all, they got the blur, they got the bleed, and now they got the wind, which is the same shit. Not really into those t-shirts. Um, hats. I'm not going to care about these bucket hats. Okay, the bandana ones will probably do good. You should get like the blues and the blacks and the browns. Those will be good, good hats. Bandanas are cool. Gore-Tex. Oh, wait. A bell hat? Oh, God, where are you going? Out Outback Expedition. Reflective patch and boonie. All right, this is your Boone hat. It's for the Boone people out there. There's your, there's his hat. Cream. Okay, it's the Kangol. Wow, a Kangol Bermuda space cap. Old English rhinestone beanie. No. Vampire boy. No. Okay, these will do okay, but they'll be more expensive. This crystal beanie, like, I don't think people are going to pay premium because they have a Swarovski, because you have Swarovski crystals on your beanie. These are great. Anytime they release these rib beanies, get a decent colorway because these are probably the best beanies that they make. These will do great. These are nice, uh, just some of their regular beanies with a nice big giant hit on them. Those will do fine. Uh, okay, we have some Gons beanies. Those will do okay. I'm going to keep going so we can get done with this. Uh, over dyed beanie. These are very nice beanies too. No, not not really interested. Okay, these are decent. The loose gauge beanies are nice beanies. I'm not a fan of the script, but it looks nice on these. Uh, are we done with beanies? Okay, so let's go to hats. That's a busy hat right there. It doesn't look bad though. It doesn't look bad though, but it's pretty busy and I don't think that'll resell. Um, no. Uh, okay, this one's kind of cool, but it's probably not going to resell. Okay, this has like a compass in it. It's kind of interesting. Maybe it's got too many accoutrements. But I don't know. Yeah, it's cool. It's all right. It'll work. Oh, no. No. This is a maybe. It's the Cordura. It's got the good back. It's got... It's really busy, though. I don't know. It's maybe too busy. I like these, but you know what? I'm not a fan of this. I know it looks nice. It's a nice leather class, but, but these are nice looking hats. I would say these will do fine. Okay. Keep going on that one. Uh, the ripstop uh, six panel, okay, yeah, black would be fine, but it's kind of a dusty color. It's not the best black. Uh, these are nice, leather visor six panel. I like that black one right there. That's a nice one. The white one, too, because with the black on it. No, no thank you. Uh, no thank you. I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, here we go. Oh, it's corduroy. What? All right, well, same thing here. The black will be probably the best one to go for. Black navy looks good here. No, 
not interested. Uh, okay, cause hat, definitely go for these. Uh, six panel, oh, five panel. Ugh, I hate five panels, but these will do well. Stick to the black, always go black if you're in doubt. Oh, no. Oh, Playboy, okay. Well, it's ugly, but it's Playboy, so. And they got a lot of five panels. Uh, I like this one, too. This is a cool hat. I like the, the black and the white one here. Uh, it's, the bones, kind of neat. I don't, I don't think so. I like those trucker hats, though. Okay, well, here we go. We got a new era. Is it fitted? Okay. Okay, the new era skull hats. I These hats are nice. Um, I think that these hats will do really, really well if you can get them in good sizes. Uh, but yeah, this is a cool hat. Uh, this hat will do fine, too. Another new era, regular new era fitted hat. Uh, the bigger sizes on hats do best. Oh, that that's a cool color, too. The nice the navy blue, black. This little baby shit color maybe oh fitted it's a gone's new era okay so another new era this might be a good one to get pick up i like the black one i really not really a fan of the others and what is this a reverse box logo wow fitted reverse box logo okay i mean they haven't done it before it's it's hard to find stuff they haven't done before even if it is just crisscrossing them so they must have taken a page out of crisscrosses handbook that's a pretty neat looking hat. Those colors don't do good, so it's like, just go black. The military cam cap, I do kind of like this colorway. Um, I sold one of these last year for like $100, and it was basically the same thing. It doesn't have, it had like the longitude and latitude on it, but it looked like the same hat. Oh, uh, leather camp cap. Um, I'm just gonna tell you that's a horrible idea. Mesh sea rucker hat, no thank you. Uh, these are all box logos, huh? Um, Twill camp cap, sure. It's not really, not really. Is this the old logo one? Yeah, this is the old logo hat. So this is a Gore-Tex with all the old logos on it. Man, I don't know. Maybe, maybe this one. But definitely go for the black one. I mean, that, that one will sell for sure. I, I don't mind it. It's okay. Camp caps are fine. Uh, I don't like those clasps in the back. I don't like the leather, but those are fine. Um, okay, the black one here I like. Uh, the rip stop. I don't know. The black ones always do fine. This this paisley hat. These will do fine in a hat form. Again, ah, why did they do that? I think that's all of the hats. Honestly, uh, yes. And if uh, if you know, I missed any, you know, you have the ability to check these out online right now. Go ahead and do it. Uh, okay, bags. Okay, this is where this is my place. Okay, all right. I always like their backpacks. I think they do really well for uh, for resale. You can't go wrong with the bags. They're really cool. Normally, I think they're one forty eight ish. That's a pretty good price. You can usually get close to two hundred for these bags. So uh, these duffel bags as well. I'm really interested in maybe grabbing uh, at least one or two of these. They're a nice size duffel bag, fifty five liters. That's a pretty decent size. Um, I do think that this black one is is a good pickup. I don't know how much they cost, obviously. So I'm not gonna say that until we see prices, but uh, sling bag. I, I wasn't a fan of the sling bag. This one though, uh, I like the way that it looks better than the one from last year. Uh, this is a tote. Okay, we had those last year. The waist bags. Um, now these paisley bandana duffels. These are a little bit smaller than the supreme duffel bags. I think these things will do good. The bigger, the bigger size in these will do do well. This is gonna be kind of small, 17 liters. That's that's not too big. Um, and then this the side bag is pretty small too, not interested. Vanson leather is going to be expensive. These are kind of neat. I just like the way that it's made. And there's a black one. I think I like the black one. Yeah. And the black one actually looks good. So if you're ever going to Jamaica and you need to go to the beach, uh, this is your guy right there. That's the one you need to take. Okay, vampire. And then they're going to do the canvas tote and bag again. Wow, look at that. Okay, are you ready? Are you ready? Let's, let's do it. This is going to be exciting. This is accessory time. One, two, three, accessory. Okay, cool. Oh my god, yeah, I saw a picture of this one. <laughs> oh my god, look at this thing. A uh, sea do, and it's got quite a paint job on it too, doesn't it? Um, I don't have a lake or a pond uh, behind me, so I'm not going to go for these. I hear these are probably going to be like a friends and family thing, but... Uh, I mean, it's pretty awesome, and I love the I love the design. That's That's been my favorite design so far uh, this year. We've got the fridge that's $1,000. I talked about that. Uh, these plates, now on the back of this plate, it says one out of 150. So if it's one out of 150, those are going to be hard to get. Who needs a plate? But at the end of the day, this is a pretty cool one. I mean, I don't know. Like, this is going to be so expensive. And it's like, unless you own a store, unless you're Cam 
from Cam's Kicks. You probably don't need a, a piece like this. Yeah, I'm not a fan. And there you go. If you want to be like Tom Brady, you just have to buy seven of these. You have to have seven different credit cards, though. So that's like, if you get seven of these, that's probably like winning the Super Bowl. Although these might sit for a while. Wheaties, we got to get those. You know that. Uh, this thing's neat. This is a, what, a drum a sampler, mixer, some type. I have no idea. I don't know anything about it. Looks really expensive, though. I can tell you that right now. Spray paint. Give the kids that are cooped up in a house some spray paint. They can huff it. Then they can go vandalize some stuff at night, just as long as they're wearing their masks. This looks like a little music box or something, but apparently it's a lamp. I guarantee you that's not going to be cheap. Disposable 35 millimeter camera, so just some disposable camera. We have a mug. Got to get a baseball bat. Now, this is a wooden bat that they chromed, and then they etched all the uh, other stuff into it. So definitely this is one to go for if it's not too crazy. The Supreme Nerf guns, those are very Easter. I bet these are going to come out around Easter. If they don't, then it's a, it's a loss. Uh, some bed sheets. Ooh, look at those bed sheets. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I'm getting those. Oh, there we go. The real, the Chase Lounge. The Sun Tannin Lawn Chair. This is great. If you got the one last year, what's awesome is it doesn't go with it because they decided to do tonal instead of the red and white. Um, kite, I bet that kite's expensive. A body board. If you live in Florida, it's all you. There's another water bottle. They never release water bottles, so you better get one of these before they release another one. We got a bike lock, or I guess it's a chain lock. It's not really a bike lock. You can chain anything you want with it. I mean... You know, this is the pocket pump. You guys need a pocket pump, a supreme pocket pump. Who doesn't want that? I feel like I wake up to an NBA game. The alarm would go up like, just throw your pillow across the room. All right, all right, we have a Jesus uh, Frisbee. There it is. Oh, we got the dice rolling the bones. Kids rolling the bones on Supreme's dime. We rolling the bones. No. If you need one there, I mean, Leatherman are nice. Okay, an iPhone 12 case. There you go. We needed that. Uh, belt. I just can't wear this kind of a belt. It's a man's belt. I understand it. I'm down. I'm a boy. It's one of the better towels I've seen from Supreme. It's just nice. It looks like a hotel towel. Gotta get. We're gonna get all the purple stuff. I'm gonna have some purple. I'm gonna have a purple undershirt, some purple drawers, and some purple socks. You know, I'm gonna have those purple socks all the way up. Uh, of course, we got the Air Force ones. So these dunks right here. These are the shoes of the year for Supreme. These are the shoes of the last two years. I haven't seen a shoe that could compete with this. Obviously, they already know. But if you're a reseller, I mean, this is you gotta try for these. These are, these are huge come up if you get them. So we got some, what, some keychains. I like that on a keychain. All right, the uh, leather keychain. These are all right. Some pins, some pins. <sighs> what? Okay, cool. Here we go. This is what I was looking for. I like these a lot. These are cause boards, obviously. Oh, man, all these colorways are good. Um, I think with any cause, though, pink is is always for some reason pink is always the best with cause the only ones i don't really like are the yellow and the red and and they're actually not that bad to be honest with you uh, the cause stuff is is a must cop everything that they do cause related is going to do very well any of the cause stuff um no i think this is a cool design i don't know if it looks as good on the boards as it does on that jacket but uh still this is a cool one i don't know i'm not i don't really like that that design too much to be fair this one, oh, this is, a, is this Prodigy? Yeah, I bet this comes out week one as well. Uh, this board is nice. It'll go nicely with the Ariel one back there. All right, so it looks like that is it. That is the entire lookbook. At the end of the day, though, I actually think it's a pretty decent lookbook. Definitely not the best lookbook that I've ever seen, but by far it's not the worst. There's some really neat items in there. And I think that this year will be another decent year for reselling supreme if that's what you're into every week there's money to be made in supreme still is it as much as it used to be no maybe not but if you know what you're looking for you'll be fine i'm gonna go through all the releases for the seat for this whole season so if you want to join me on that journey make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel anyways thank you so much for joining me this has been a very long video if you've made it to the end comment your og disciple below if you made it to the end because you definitely are and also if you want join the free uh discord it's my f discord fauntleroy's finest um, we will be talking Supreme all season long. We talk everything, streetwear, shoes, Pokemon, whatever the heck anybody in there is talking about. So feel free to do that. Join us. And I hope you have a good one. See you later. I feel like I'm chosen. I'm covered in gold.